Hi, this is lesson number 37 from our Photoshop training series. In this exercise, we are going to learn how to add realistic water splash in your image using layer mask technique. Here in my screen, I have two images, glass with the water and the other image is water splashes. This type of images you can easily Google for your practice purpose. This water splash we are going to add in this image. In my case, the water splash is with the blue shade. Even if you can find grayscale, that works. That is also fine. So the first thing, we are going to transfer this image in this canvas. So I will click on move tool, click and drag. So that image is here. To locate accurately, we can reduce the opacity. Just resize and place it the way you want. Hit enter and bring back to 100. Using blend mode also we can achieve the water splash effect. We can change the blend mode. Let's try and divide. Somehow it works. But clearly you can see the light blue area when it's blended with the background it is having green tone. And the other thing in this area in the glass there is a yellow tone it is because the layer is blended with the background to get the perfect water splash with the correct color tone we can use layer mask technique so let's go back to normal and the first step here is to make selection to add selection with this image we can press control key and click on the layer thumb actually we are going to copy the content from the layer and we will paste it in our layer mask. Directly we cannot paste the layer content in the layer mask. It is only possible if the layer mask is displayed in our canvas. The first thing we are going to make selection. So press control key and click in the layer thumb. This is one way to make selection. Control D to deselect. There is another way you can right click on the thumb and also you can click on select pixel. So this is how we can make also selection. The third method is from the menu bar, control D. You can go to select and then click on load selection. Simply click OK. Now we have selection. Once the selection is there, press control C. Now our layer content is loaded on the clipboard. We are going to paste in the layer mask. So layer 1 is selected, simply click on add layer mask and this thumb is presenting the layer mask. To view the layer mask in our canvas, we can press alt key and click on the layer mask. Now we can see the mask in our screen. It is very important to display the layer mask in the canvas. This way we can paste the content from layer to the layer mask. Remember we press Ctrl C, our layer content is on the clipboard. Now we are in the layer mask and we will press Ctrl Shift V. And here on the layer mask thumb you can see the water splash. Now let's invert the mask by pressing Ctrl I. Make sure that the layer mask thumb is selected. Press Ctrl I and our mask is inverted. For now keep the selection as it is and fill white color in your layer thumb. Now here in our layer we don't need any more water splashes. So we can fill it with the white color. This is the process we need to add white color. To do that we need to select the layer thumb. We can press alt key and click in the layer mask or we can directly click on the layer thumb. Now layer content from background and layer 1 displayed on the canvas. The selection is there. Layer thumb is selected. We can press Alt and Backspace. The color is added. And that's all. Now we can press Ctrl D to deselect. If you think the effect is not strong, you can duplicate the layer. And now we can control by opacity this way. Here you can observe the layer is transparent, the transparency is there. By pressing control key we can select the layer 1 
and we can right click and link them so now wherever we want we can move we can adjust and that's all this is how easily realistic water splash we added in our image using layer mask technique we copy and paste the layer content in the layer mask and itself layer we fill with the white color that's all for now i hope you enjoy this lesson if you like this video make sure that you hit the subscribe button and click on the bell notification so you will be notified every time i upload new video thank you